Now, what if I wanted our segment that's 25% longer rather than 50% longer? Well, I've already done this. I didn't feel the need to uh, fumble around with the equipment, you know, the, the instruments on the screen, but uh, I went ahead and bisected the segment from here to here. Now, I'll just say, uh, kind of trace this over in red and trace this bisector in red to show that that's a new construction. I'm not going to bother tracing over the arcs. We know where the arcs came from once we see what we're bisecting. And now it should be clear that uh, this distance is 25% of the original length. So that if I uh, take my compass at these two points and extend then the original line, there was the original length, I get the point at which the line segment would be 25% longer. So I'm going to draw that. Uh, I can't really draw it right on top because I'll obliterate the original line, but I'm going to draw it right below. And right here is a line 25% longer. So I'm going to write here 25% longer. Up here and I'm going to write 50% longer. And then I'm going to write down the fact that 50% uh, longer is 150% of, so I've increased the length of the segment by a factor of 1.5. Okay, so uh, the orange graph, the one that's 50% longer, increased the length of the original by factor 150%, but that's a factor of 1.5, or if I wish to write it as a fraction, and that can be a useful thing, 3 halves. And actually we're going to talk more about fractions than we are about decimals. Um, okay. So, and remember, if we increase something by a factor of three halves, it gets three halves times as big. Okay, one and a half times as big, which is half again as long or 50% longer or bigger. Okay, and this one, is an increase in length. over the original by factor 1.25 or in fractions 5 fourths. Okay. Now, it should be obvious that we can make something 75 percent longer. Okay, we could, for example, construct something 50 percent longer and then take the 25 percent that we can get here and add on to that. Uh, to get 75% uh, longer. 125% longer, well, just get a big compass and get the original, do the original again, then add your 25%. So we can get any of these uh, results. So um, it should be clear then that the fraction, if it's 25% longer, it's five fourths as long. What's the fraction for 125 percent? What's the fraction for 75 percent? 125 percent longer, 75 percent longer. So my next question is, what length factors Can we construct?
you should ponder this question.